Aha e yo bifu radio mo son fo bifu kwa mjwami na maje bre. E de tuwa mo ma kwa mkwa enu yase. Mo nyume mo fi fi mu. E ni bebi bera wa we enjoy video yi. Na me kayo se ha e yo bifu radio. E na wone yen e di eshia. Si bia e nene de di ka wo shwe. An aso ta shwe na wanyan subscribe wo son master wo sobe subscribe wo. Sa bia latest and trending stories bia di betu mo no wo sabe ka. Aha. Di e di te pa. Na se di e di shwe. Di wunye ti an kape di wunye an kape peti trim. Se fa abatu wano hon sen sem diye. Aha ne dini yina ayeden ebre mou. E aswa fwa shen kom. Malam fwa shen kom. E minfani se e di fonsu shen kom. En akon fonsu e shen kom. Ni yina benyan wwa obyen fwa radio. Ne ene diye di ebre mou. E ye. E ye. Prophet. Levite ziwonu. Prophet. Levite ziwonu. Anase wubi tumide kres en susu akahon. Prophet kres. Levite ziwonu. Ono, ene ne, o se ni buwa fuye pa, o tu tubi, e de amane, e ye Zimbabwean prophet, a ye freno, prophet Angel Ubet. O so pe so, kasa chero prophet Angel Ubet se, e nyon kwa ni difuwa wasa a si isu ha wo. E nyon kwa ni difuwa wasa a si isu ya, na de biya o sori ya, watam o man penida da jom do meni mahama, akro ni se sirene abasa. O se shwe, o se ma wo kaya nunti on fi wo no, he, wati dada, o nim dada. Wa jinye nye di, ya nitra wa nji wundi eno. Eh, prophet isi, wa kachire prophet enji wubet isi. Wa nji wundi yo, yewa jondoman mama, wa nji wundi, ya nitra wa nsusa wun semsu ono. Wa di, wa nfre, wa nfre, wa nfre wun inti. Wa su beshen kumdi ama, ya ye, Dr. Baumia. Wa si he, wa pa shen kumfuma Dr. Baumia. Wa kachire uplin, yewa jondoman mama bedi mkwini, ama Dr. Baumia. Wa su ma, 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 on the 7th, dizemba abatu ya babe tu ono. Enu on the 9th, on the 10th, ya mbobo ane diye. Na yura John Domain Mahama edi inkwenim. Aha, ayo binfu radio. Yen sa antwa sonye fa di eko sonye na fa mremo. People keep on sending me. My time is up, but people keep on sending me. A video that there is this prophet called Hubert Angel. There are things he is saying. And you know, from the beginning, I was a man of God who was speaking predominantly about Mahama, you know, I'm talking about about the election 2024, as this year is concerned. Uh, I was the man of God who was predominantly talking about he becoming a president and all the things God have said about him and etc. So these are most of the people of NDC people. In the beginning, many even was thinking that I'm a <laughs> Muhammad's prophet. So I just talking about the things God have revealed to me about him. So when they saw these some of these videos, they keep sending to me. Uh, they are asking me, so what do I think? What do I think? What do I think? So I don't know. Maybe I'll come clear on that one. And but this is what I can say shortly about that. Hibet Angel is a nice prophet, but he doesn't have authority over Ghana. No, he doesn't. He doesn't have authority over Ghana. And uh, and anything that he has seen uh, about Ghana were things that we're talking about long time ago. We have said it, we have to start talking about it many, many years ago. And some of the things that have to do with Mahama disobedient and all those things i was the man of god who even when he was in government i was the man of god who got revealed to and i went there and etc the rest the rest is history this year we continue to pursue him and he obeyed when he had the first uh, uh, uh this thing with the clergy uh is it fellowship with the clergy or so he 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 made a promise to correct those errors you know so in the realm of the of light, uh, there is no accusation against Mahama anymore. Okay, there is no accusation. So anything any man of God is seeing and talking about, you know, Ibe Eje is a nice prophet, and I respect every man of God. Okay, I respect every man of God. But uh, if the videos they sent to me are current videos, then. Uh, I would advise him that you should, you should be careful because honestly speaking, when God told Balaam to stop doing something and Balaam, out of profit, continued to go the way he went, God sent angels of death against him. But he never saw it. He took his donkey to save him. So, you had angel. I mean, you are not the only man of God that God is speaking to about the things in which you are touching. If whatever you are talking about is something new, we understand. But anything you are talking about, God has revealed it to us long time ago. 
we submitted it to Mahama already. And Mahama has been obedient to it. So, the, there is one of the videos, I think he was talking about the injunction. You have no authority to place injunction on Mahama. You don't have that authority. You can be tickling yourself, but I'm telling you, as a senior apostle, you don't have any authority over Mahama. You don't have it. You, I'm saying it out of respect to you, because you are a fellow man of God. It's this. Whatever Hubert Angel you are talking about, if you are not received the response you needed from Mahama, it is simply because the thing you are talking about, he already knew. Because we are subject documents in regards to that to him already. And he has come open the instruction God gave for him to follow. He is following them. So if you are not receive response from him as you wanted, it is simply because he already knew the things you are saying. Because you are not the first prophet who has spoken it. We started saying it many years ago. Even when he was in government, we were telling him about it. When he's out of government, he realized that the thing we we're telling me is true. And so, when he stood again, and we call his attention to it, we are bombarding him with that message. He came out to correct it, to vow to God as God instructed. So there is no more condemnation or accusation against Mahama. Whatever you think you are seeing, go back and see it well. With all this respect, my brother, go back and see it well. Because you don't have any jurisdiction and authority here in Ghana over any, you don't have it. You don't have it. God can be speaking to you. But I'm telling you, from the realms of light, that you don't have any authority or any power over John Dramani Mahama. You don't have any authority, any power over as the election of Ghana is concerned, as election 2024 is concerned. You don't have any authority. You don't have any power over our nation. You don't have any power over any candidate. Yes, you are a fine gentleman, a fine prophet of God. You believe in your unction, and we respect that. But listen, you don't have authority and jurisdiction in Ghana. Not, you don't. Predominantly because the things you are talking about, they are not news to us. We know it already. And I'm speaking like this because I have played an equivocal role in this matter of any work of disobedience of Mahama as Ghana's group elections, his contribution to the nation is concerned. And we have pushed him, and the man has humbly all the things you have seen about him, a fine man, all those things. We saw it already. We have we started announcing him and saying it before even you have seen anything. So if Mahama is not responding to you the way you you wanted, it is because he knew what you are saying already. It is not news to us. It is not news to Mahama. He knows it. Everything that you think you know you want to say. He knows it because we have already delivered those messages to him before you begin to see them. You saw them because he was being a uh, recalcitrant in listening from the beginning. That is the reason. And before even you come out to talk, we said it already, that because he was not obedient at that time, still people will be seeing that there is a level of disobedience around him. We said it before even you begin to talk, Hubert Angel. But the man has the obedience to what God said it should be done. And it is done. He has been obedient to God, and he will keep on being obedient to God. There is no dust and dot of disobedience in his way. As the things God wants him to do. So you don't have jurisdiction, you don't have authority, you don't have any authority to lay any injunction on Mahama or our election. You don't have it. You don't have it. But it will be okay if you gently stop those kind of expressions. If you, you, it's your church, it's your platform. You can come and say anything you want to say. But there is nothing you see that will hold a bearing on Ghana's election 2024. Because you don't have jurisdiction, you don't have the power, you don't have the authority to reign over the nation of Ghana. As our election is concerned, or any of our presidential candidates is concerned. 
if other presidential candidates will have it with a tickly heart because they want to become president to control to pursue you, you can go ahead and do with them. But as our nation Ghana is concerned, as John Dramani Mahama is concerned, as he really election is concerned, you don't have any authority to lay any kind of injunction on him. Because whatever it is that he did wrong, 